Alright, so today I made a beat strictly in the uh, 2400 and I was about to track it out and I figured, you know what, I haven't done a video showing how I track out in this. So we're going to start with Ableton today. I do one in Logic later this week and then I'll do one in Luna and one in Pro Tools. Uh, so you can see how I track it up. So you see I got Ableton up here. I got it synced via MIDI. Okay, so let me show you preferences so for me mine's is going through my motu i'm not using the usb okay so i got my my motu select my micro express four is my 2400 all right so i got those synced and i got did with some timing and all that stuff that's going to be computer specific so there's no reason even to break it down then i mapped everything out so I'm using a uh, Behringer ADA 8200 with my Apollo. And so my 2400 is, is mapped out on that, okay? Eight out. I got each channel going in the end, external end, and then the channel. The only channel I got that's stereo is one and two. That's where I got my main sample. Everything else is monoed out, all right? Uh, let me see. I'll bring my console over here so y'all can see what I got going on my console. So, uh, so the 2400 on my stereo output, I got the Studer 800 to give it some some tape saturation. Uh, API 560 because I wanted to take some frequencies out for that specific sample that I was using. And then I put a chorus on it to give it some width. Okay. My drums, my standard SSL shaped it for the little thump I wanted. The uh, snare, I use a fat so a uh, A800 and a transit designer to give it some pop and to bring the transit down a little bit that the uh, envelopes wasn't quite giving the effect that I wanted. I got tape effects going on all of my, my inputs. And then I got a, uh, a yeah effect. Yeah, 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 yeah. I wanted that echo on it. So I put the uh, SDD 3000 on it and another tape effect. <laughs> My bass, I put a distortion on it. I learned that from knots. That shit is hard. And then that's the bass thump. Oh, this is the sample. That you hear without it, the effects. up a little bit give it some shimmer put it all together and you get this all right i'm going to let it track out i got to go in through my sub buses my drum and bass bus my like effects and and stuff like that the yeah is going through this one the sample is going through this one let's go ahead and record it and then we'll go from there some questions for somebody um yeah happy creating y'all i'll y'all later peace